Okay. Hello, Humata Project friends. We are going to show you how to collect uh, information in the river, uh, certain parameters such as pH and temperature, uh, salinity. But the most important parameter that we're looking for is turbidity, or how much sediment is in the river. So this is your HANA instrument. Um, the first thing we're going to do when you get it out of the box, you're going to have these main parts, the cable, the probe itself, and the computer. And so you have to plug in the computer first, screw this in tightly, and then before you go out in the field, you want to get a Ziploc bag, put this around, and it is water resistant, but we want to put the bag on it just in case. So you seal it around here, and you duct tape it around the base, and it should be good to go. But for this video, I'm going to take it out of the bag so you can see what we're doing clearly. All right, so for the HANA instrument, you push the red button to turn it on. Okay, and this only works well after it's plugged in. So it tells you what probes are connected. You don't have to worry about that. We just go straight to measure. Select measure, then select log, and then we're going to scroll down to start probe log. This is the one you will use at each site in the river. Start probe log. Okay, so we would this gives you a chance to add a note or a remark. So we would like to add a remark, yes. And select new. Now you can type this in like you're texting on your old phone. So for example, if we we're going to do samples in the Fool River, we can do F R and one. So Fool River one will be our first site. That's our remark. Accept. Then, after you make that remark, press OK. Skip the tag reader. We don't have this read tag, so don't worry about that. Just skip. This is telling you what uh, parameters will be logged. Uh, that all looks good, so just press OK. Alright, so now the probe log is starting and as you can see on this side I already I'm putting the you should do this before you press start the probe will be in the river and you want to leave it in the river continuously logging data for about 10 minutes after 10 minutes it's not going to tell you on this so you'll have to use a timer or just look at your watch click on stop probe log And that's it. That's all there is to it for your first data sample. And uh, if you need to know later on, uh, if you want to make sure that your that something was logged down, you can scroll down to log recall. Select that. Since we did a probe log, you go to probe log recall. Select the lot. So there's only one lot right now because we only did one sample and it's always going to be labeled P log 001 or 002. So that so you have to take good notes to keep track of what P log was what sample. All right, so it says it took 31 samples. That means it measured uh, it took one sample every second, so we were measuring for 31 seconds or for 31 seconds. If um, you measure for 10 minutes, you're going to have way more samples, so we want to see that number a lot higher. And don't worry about download, just escape, and I'll download this when I get the instrument back from you in the mail. Okay, you just keep escaping, and when you're going to start your next one, go to log again, start probe log. Wait a few seconds. All right. Add remark. Yes. We want to make a new one again. F 
Fuller River 2. Okay, but also put that in your notes just in case these remarks don't show up well. So okay, skip the tag reader. Select okay for your log summary again. And there you go. Wait 10 minutes. Make sure your, pro your probe is okay in the water. Okay, and then stop probe log. Alright, and that's all you gotta do. Uh, later on, after you're done with the probe, you wanna rinse this out under fresh water. Rinse, rinse this out under fresh water, dry it up with a paper towel, and then, where is that other thing? Okay. Then you put a, mo a little piece of moist paper towel down at the bottom of this, and you just close it back up, put it back in the box, I'll give you the FedEx number, and you can ship it back to us here in Hawaii. Alright, thank you very much.